Oh, sir, who's that? Oh, well, it's me, guys, it's me, hold on. It's me, it's Gemma. I was just hiding from you underneath this mop of hair. Um, I have tea and I made it before the video, it's going cold. You inconsiderate bastards keeping me from my tea. Now it's only lukewarm. I wanted it to be Gemma hot. My friend Luke won't appreciate that. He's quite warm. So, I wanted to show you something on my computer. Oh, this is where I keep my computer. Over in this area. My lights up there. This is where I keep my phone. This is where I keep my tea. That's where I keep my dead bodies. And my pens. Let's get to it! The, the name of the game is Will You Press The Button? Have you heard of it? So what we're gonna do we're gonna do, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna switching hands. Switching hands with my tea first. This is why I don't like keeping the tea bag in the cup. You know how some people keep the tea bag in the cup? It just gets in the way. Like who? What sort of insanity is this? Tea bag. It's so loose and just like where does it go? What does it do? It's not tied down or anything. It's just free. I don't understand. I can't live like this. If you don't know what Will You Press The Button is, it's this site. Um, the site's called willyoupressthebutton.com. Convenient. Too convenient. Almost like the site name was made for the game. So there's um, a picture and there's these terms down the bottom. You get like one, usually it's one good one plus a bad one and you have to decide whether you will put up with the bad one to have that good one. And what you do, if you like the scenario, press the button, you accept it. And if you don't, then you click that little red button that says I will not with an explanation point which kind of sounds like you really object to it, like it offends you. So it's like I will not and that's the button you press. If you will not. This is a very convenient game. So, let's play. Okay, first question. You are reborn into the world and can decide your new appearance, gender, social status, etc, etc. And retain your memories. Good. But you must do it again every time you turn 16. Like, it's like having a new go- Okay, so you're immortal. No, this is basically the, do you want to be immortal? Because, you know, your friends die and it's bad. And everyone knows being immortal would be crap, or at least that's what we're, like, tricked into thinking. Because not everyone can be immortal and everyone knows that. No, because I can't, because I like people. And people die, and I kind of want to die first. I will not! Next question! Amazing, oh, okay. Amazing skill in every video game you play. So I'm assuming that means you have an amazing, okay, all right, all right. But you will not be able to taste food. Pfft, I'm not doing that. I don't even play video games. It's a ridiculous skill to have. And I'm not like, oh, don't say that on YouTube. Shit. <laughs> Alrighty, next question. I'm not gonna lie, I just kind of want to drink my tea. Um, you can stop time for an unlimited amount of time. You can start and stop time whenever you want. You can move around and do whatever you want during these periods. Cool. But you you age three times faster when you when time is stopped. <gasps> Ooh. Well, no, that's that's all right because it makes you limit your gift. Like you use it on like real special times and like I because you know if you pause time enough. You'd want to pause it all. No, that's I would do that. Because then you could stop time just once and it wouldn't really affect your timeline. Yeah. Press the button. Press the button! Next question. You live your ideal life. That's ideal. But every time you take a step, it feels like you're stabbing, stubbing your toe. <laughs> I hate stubbing my toe. Is it enough to put up with that to live like a king? Yeah, I want to be a king, don't want to be a queen. I want to be a king, not like the like the male part, just I like the title. It's got a K in it. I get completely immobilized when I stub my toes, so I'm not doing that, because I go, like, I'd be who I want to be, but I wouldn't be able to enjoy it, because I'd be immobilized. Tia's been drunk. 
we drunk the tea. You never see My Little Pony stuff again and eventually no bronies are left. But they move on to a different revamp of a show from your childhood and twice as many people sexualize it. What's the point in that question? I don't get that. So what? They're just gonna destroy something else I love. Even worse. No. No. Could you imagine them doing that to like... Gumby? What? <laughs> what else would they do that to? That was a kid's show. Like Care Bears. Oh, I got the worst visions in my head of Care Bear porn. I will not. Next question. You don't need to sleep ever again, but you will only have one ear and one eye. See, the pluses of not being needing to sleep would be you had so much more time to like improve skills. The only skills I'd really want to improve involve drawing. Can you draw? Like, can you draw okay still with one eye? You know what? Yeah, I'll do it. Facebook shuts down, but Tumblr shuts down at the same time. Uh, what? I don't really like either of those things. Okay. I mean, I like, like, I like them. It's not gonna be horrible without the <laughs> click in the button. Next, next, next. You have telekinesis. What's telekinesis again? Google. Tell me what it is. Is a non-damaging psychic type move introduced in Gen Vic? No, <laughs> no. What? What is it? What is it actually? Oh, so it's like moving stuff. Okay, all right. You can move stuff with your mind, but you are paralyzed from the neck down. What? Can, 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 does that mean you can move your own body with the telekinesis? Can you move your own limbs? You should do. You, you can move anything. Click the button. Outsmarted. Learn to play perfectly. Any instrument of your choice. Ooh, but you can't play it to other people. So I'm guessing that means that no one can hear it. What is the point? I guess it's for your own enjoyment. Why not? I wouldn't mind being able to play perfectly to myself. I'm a special lady. Your urine escapes painlessly as a pleasant smelling vapor. Okay, so you're like a giant glade candle or like glade air freshener. All right. But everybody who finds out wants you to pee on them, but never says anything about it. So what, they, they want you to, but they never say anything. So how does that affect me? That's okay. My urine escapes as a pleasantly smelling vapor. That's okay. They can say it if they want to. I'll press that button. Your room is always clean and organized, but there is always three spiders in your room you can never catch or kill. It's like my room now, but it's not clean. But you know, they're, they're not hurting anybody. I've probably eaten them while I've slept. You know what, they probably influenced my diet a bit. I'll probably have a little bit more protein in my diet because I eat spiders while I sleep. Doesn't affect me. We click the button. Next one. Your music library is perfectly sorted, tagged, and covered. I haven't got that many songs, but okay. But you have to listen to One Direction at least once per day. I like One Direction. It's a small price to pay. But like, it can be different songs. It can be like, it's not the same repetitive song every day. No, I'll do that. It could be worse. You finally get the fame and celebrity you worked your whole life for on a hit TV show. Oh, finally! But you fall in love with your married co-star. Is that bad? I don't have to have an affair. I can just fall in love with them. Do I only have to fall in love with them? Can I fall in love with someone else? Ugh. I want a TV show! But I don't want to fall in love with someone who's married. No, nah, I'll stick with my YouTube channel. I, I have morals, guys. I have morals. Look at me. Not getting my own TV show because I have morals. You can time travel! I don't have one of these. Okay, I can time travel. But you can only stay in that time period for 10 minutes or else you get stuck there forever. That's still pretty cool. It's got a little time limit. That's alright. No, that's good. I think that's healthy even. It's healthy to have a time limit on your time travel, I find. Click the button. Click the button. Ooh, you can fly anytime, anywhere. Yes, but your mum will hate you forever. <laughs> My mum will hate me forever if I can fly anytime and anywhere I want. I like my mum. 
She would actually hate me if I could do that. I think she'd be a bit jealous. It's kind of selfish of her. I will not. I will not. I like my mum. She just don't want her to hate me. Because I can fly and she can't. You become the most sexually attractive person on the planet. Already there. But you fall madly in love with every person you see. Already there. <laughs> fall madly in love with every person. No, that sounds lovely. To be that intoxicate, to be that intoxicated all the time and be really attractive. Mm. I know, I like that. I like that. That's a nice. I think it's cute. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we'll click that. We'll click that button. We'll click the button. What's wrong with being in love? The world is rid of hunger, greed, bigotry, and above other things, hate. Okay. It's okay. So, good. But you become technologically Ill Ill illiterate. Oh. <laughs> And you cannot use nor own electronic digital devices. So I'm like camping for the rest of my life. But the world is good, because I'm camping. That sounds lovely. I go on a camping trip and everyone's happy. Ah, good, yes. Click the button. You can marry your celebrity crush, but you will become blind. I'm sure if they got to know me, they'd be all right. Pretty, pretty sure my celebrity crush isn't even like a celebrity. I mean like a YouTube celebrity. Crash, bang, Adam? Nah. He has a missus. Can't do that. No, we're not clicking this button. We're not clicking this button. Adam will never love me. <gasps> you will save thousands if you press the red button. <laughs> this is the red button. But you will die afterwards. Oh, this is creepy. I don't want to die. I will save thousands if I press- who- what- thousands of what? You will save thousands. Like thousands of dollars? <laughs> I will save thousands of dollars by dying after pressing the red button! I don't like this. This is- no, this isn't specific enough. I'm passing. No. Also, I don't want to die. You will acquire all of the powers, abilities of the superhero you choose. Oh, so it's a pre-existing one. Okay. Oh, I can't think of a good one. Let's just go Superman to be safe. Because I wouldn't mind being able to fly and be strong and have that gorgeous hair. But you also put everyone you love and care in severe danger and risk of death. Because you're Superman. But it's okay because I'm going to wear glasses. It's good. Click the button. I shouldn't have clicked that button. <laughs> this is getting weird. I can't get past the one where it says my mum will hate me if I fly. Your words make everyone love you and respect you. Oh. I like to think I do that now. But you can't talk to people until they've touched your genitals. So like, normal, right? <laughs> I only let certain people touch my genitals. And that is reserved for my gynecologist. I will not click that one. These are just getting, these are just getting strange. 10 times faster internet than you pr presently have. Oh my, yes! I should really read the second part of the questions, but can only download 20 gigabytes of stuff a month. That, what is the point? Like what? No. <laughs> I will not. I like this one. It's kind of like, it, it's giving me a compliment. You are an incredible kisser. Great in bed. And are incredibly charming to the opposite sex. Thank you. But you have to constantly have a paper cut on the end of five random fingers for the rest of your life. After one heals, another one immediately appears. Oh, why? This is okay. I don't mind this. <laughs> Rather this than have paper cuts on my fingers and look fantastic. I will not. I will not. You know what? I'm clicking a lot of will nots in this. But when I do click a button, I click it hard. Okay. You will be a god. But nothing, every. <laughs> oh, I get it. You will be a god, but nothing. Everything will be normal. You'll be a god. <laughs> Click the button. You can have sex with anybody in the world. Okay. But the body would have the mind and voice of one of your parents. Ah! <laughs> Ew. Maybe if, like, paper bag and just block it out. Oh, no! No, I will not. Oh, you get $50,000. I hope that's Australian. 
But someone you don't know will die. Do you really know your husband? What is that question mark? Why? Will they die as the result of me getting $50,000? No, I can't do that. It's like killing someone for $50,000. No, I'm not doing it. No. It's like, I'm not an assassin. I got out of that a long time ago. You can have any power. So sick of these questions. But there is someone else always on the news with the same power and is better at it than you. <laughs> But I still get the power, it just means there's always someone better than me, so it's like, it's just like real life. Like, I'm good at stuff, but there's always someone better. It, I guess it got be, knowing that you could never be better than them would be upsetting. You, I get over it, I get over it. Yeah, click the button, click the button. Infinite money and power. Awesome. But, you lose your legs. <sighs> like, do I lose them? Like, do I just misplace them and then I find them later? I mean that, okay look, money and power would be lovely, like I would love that, that would be good, but, you know, I've grown to like my legs. I'm not, I'm not clicking it, no, no clicking. Okay, five million dollars, oh thanks, but you have an unshavable permanent unibrow, <laughs> I have five million dollars, but I have a unibrow that I cannot shave off. That's alright, I'll just wear a fridge, every single day for the rest of my life. Or I'll paint it, I'll bleach it here, and no one will- no one will know. Click the button! Click the button, that's easily hidden. You get straight A's in your tests. It's a little bit late for that. But you are employed at McDonald's for eight years before you can move to another job. <laughs> it's already too late for that. <laughs> I just- I don't understand. Do I click it because it's relevant, or do I like- I am so tired. Okay, I'm clicking I will not to this question. What is the age bracket for this game? You will get one US dollar every time you blink. Oh, okay. But every time you blink, you get a really sharp pain in your eye and you go blind for 10 seconds. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I will not. No, that, no. You may gaze into someone else's future. Cool. But there's a 50-50 chance you look into your own future without realizing it. Ugh. Ugh. That's scary. No, I will not. Why would I do that? I'm not, I don't want that. No. I'm getting slowly more aggravated at these questions. I'm like, no. Why would I want that? No. You are immortal. Cool. I don't want to be immortal. You lose your memory every 200 years. I don't want to be more. Oh, wait, mate, that's pretty cool. Because you lose your memories and you don't remember the people that like died in that 200 years. So it's kind of like you're restarting all over again, but the same body. So I'd be this forever. Yes, it is quite late. And those questions were quite stupid. Had nothing to do with anything. I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> I actually, oh, I actually stopped myself from sneezing because I was that afraid of spilling my tea on the keyboard. Oh. Sheer willpower, kids. This is what triumph looks like. Like you just bit a lemon.